Hello again there, Star Wars Collectors, the Airborne Trooper here yet again. This is kind of an update video on what I recently finished within the past couple of weeks. Um, finished this over spring break, so probably like two, three weeks ago I finished this one up. And um, just to let you know, this is being taken on my iPod. Um, sideways view, I'm not sure if that changes like the um, way it is horizontally. Um, uh, on the screen, and I'm not sure if this is, like, bad quality image, so, um, please let me know, and, yeah, I'm, I'm trying this new thing where you get, like, this thing for YouTube to up, to upload videos from mobile devices by emailing it to that number thing, and, um, they'll automatically upload it, so, I'm gonna try that out, so, here is my Commander Cody helmet. You can see it's weathered everywhere, practically all around. If you could see that, all everywhere. And did add the orange detailing right here. Um, of course, the orange fin right up there, and this orange visor. This visor was made out of cardboard and tape, so it's thicker than the last one. Um, the last one was made out of, um, just, uh, for sale signs, so, yeah. This light was from a dollar store, and, uh, I just painted the end red. Um, it only works sometimes, it only works when it wants to, and yeah, you can take it off from Velcro, but, um, yeah, it's not working right now. Um, it's dollar store quality, but, yeah. And the whole visor can be removed from Velcro right there. And then on the other side, right there, and it just sits on that Velcro piece in the middle. And um, here is the visor. You can see that right there. Um, the visor. So it looks just like that. There's the side of it right there. Looks cool. Um, I'm going to leave the visor off for now. This end piece right here was made out of a pencil sharpener right here. This was a little pencil sharpener that I found just put tape over it this piece right here was a piece from a plastic coat hanger right there um i just cut that rod off and just put it there and it's that's velcro and so you could take it off too but i'm not going to take it off um so there's the side right there there's the back along there yeah it's completely weathered if you could see that right there on the side and then if you notice I did add metal wire mesh right there, um, so it looks more realistic right there. And yes, I did fill in this. That's not made by Bondo, by the way. That's not made with Bondo. Um, I just, yeah, I did a kind of a cheap method of doing that because um, Bondo just too, took too much time and to sand and everything. So um, what I what I really did was took. Um, I believe it was a for sale sign piece um, for that and just put tape over it and uh, just paint it over it basically so <laughs> um, yeah it's basically what it looks like f for that right there and um, there's the visor back there now for my Captain Rex helmet if you guys remember that it's right there um, I, I kept it the same Here, I'm gonna turn on this little thing right there. There's the light. I kept it the same. I just added weathering everywhere like I did to um, Commander Cody's. So if you saw the video of my Captain Rex helmet, it looks exactly the same as that, but just weathered completely. So it looks more more like the Clone Wars Captain Rex, because if you remember, Clone Wars Captain Rex is super weathered. So yeah, um, back to Commander Cody right here um i'm gonna put the visor back on right just like this i hope you guys enjoyed this video um hope you guys enjoy these helmets um these are my only two helmets that i have right now commander cody and of course captain rex up there but um uh maybe in the future i'll, I'll do some more I've been really wanting to do a Commander Bly, Commander Gree, and everything, but, uh, Commander Cody, I really like the way he came out. He just looks awesomely spectacular. 
he looks like the sideshow um phase one version of Commander Cody. Um looks really really cool. And yes, this is made out of the Hasbro um Star Wars clone trooper uh helmet with the added uh accessory pieces. So yeah, that basically wraps this up. I hope you um get to see this video. I hope the quality isn't that bad. Um and I hope it comes out uh all right. If it doesn't, I'll probably be deleting this, reshooting it on my other camera. This is just a test to see if um my iPod can actually take good quality videos for my channel. So yeah, thank you for watching. Um please like, comment and subscribe and as always, of course, may the force be with you.